Unraveling the Meaning of Orthodox Doctrine. Hello and welcome. In today's lesson, we're going to dive into the meaning and usage of the phrase Orthodox Doctrine. This phrase can be quite sophisticated, but worry not. We'll break it down together, making it simple and understandable. Whether you're a student, a professional, or just someone curious about the English language, this video is crafted for you. So, let's get started. First, let's decipher the word orthodox. Orthodox is an adjective that describes something traditional, conventional, or generally accepted. It's often used in the context of religion, but it can apply to any set of beliefs, principles, or practices that are widely accepted and have been established for a long time. For example, an orthodox method in cooking might mean following a traditional recipe strictly without any personal twists. Moving on to doctrine. Doctrine is a noun, and it refers to a set of beliefs held and taught by a church, a political party, or any other group. It's like a formal body of principles that are considered to be the true and correct teachings. These principles guide the actions, decisions, and thoughts of the members of the group. Combining the two words, orthodox doctrine refers to a set of beliefs or principles that are traditional and widely accepted within a particular group, especially within a religious context. It's the core, the foundation that hasn't changed much over time and is strictly followed by the members of the group. This phrase can be used in various contexts, not just religion, to indicate that certain beliefs or practices are traditional and have a strong foundation within a group or society. Let's see some examples of how orthodox doctrine might appear in sentences. The priest explained the orthodox doctrine of the church to the newcomers. Despite modern scientific discoveries, some prefer to stick to the orthodox doctrine that has been passed down for generations. The political candidate was criticized for not adhering to the party's orthodox doctrine. And that's a wrap on orthodox doctrine. We hope this video has shed light on this profound phrase and made it a bit more accessible and less daunting. Remember, language is the bridge that connects us all, and understanding such phrases enriches that connection. If you found this video helpful, give us a thumbs up, and don't forget to subscribe for more engaging language content. Until next time, keep learning and exploring.